Well, I have, uh, I brought a, a picture, uh, Dr. Uh, Ed, Edward Dixon, and he was one of the first mission developers. He became sort of like a mentor, you know, to me. Um, he would tell me, one of the things he would tell me, he says, don't let the church do to you what they did to me, <laughs> you know, what he would say. But he was dedicated, he was dedicated to the church. But at the time when he when he could not he couldn't make it anymore, he had been in parsonages and so forth. And then he and his wife were now in an apartment, and uh, he couldn't afford it. So I remember, I remember he called the bishop, and he asked the bishop, he said, "Is there any assistance that you can give to help me? Because I I've, I've been building churches all around the country, and now says uh, I don't have a parsonage. I don't have a I, I wasn't able to build up a mortgage and take care of it, and so all that kind of thing. And then he said, the bishop said to him, he said, look says, we can't do much for you. He said, but what we can do, we have two, two rooms up at the Lutheran home, and we could put you and Mrs., uh, Mrs. Dixon there. He said, but that's the best we can do. But then uh, after serving so long, and then he, his wife said, she called him, she said, she called him daddy. He said, daddy, come here. She said, tell her, show the bishop the door out. <laughs> show that. So she said, let him go, you know. Because <laughs> she wasn't moving no two, two, uh, two rooms up there. <laughs> <laughs> at the nursing home, and that was bad.